my name is Yuan Yuan. Um, today I'm going to tell you the benefit of um, shopping online. How many of you like to shop online? Um, okay. If you don't like, it's okay. Today I'm going to tell you the benefit of shopping online. With a busy schedule like us, online shopping can save a lot of our time. According to our research that was done by UC Berkeley stuff, stated that online buying expense have increased 26% in 2010 compared with 2009. There are three reasons why shopping online is beneficial. The reason are convenience, um, research capability, and environmental benefits. Um, my first reason is on convenience. Online shopping allows you to shop 24 hours a day and seven days a week. As a result, cus cus customers can shop regardless of their schedule. And second, um, it's um, you can send gifts to your friends. Um, online shopping is a great place to get last minute gifts, such as, um, for example, you forget your, tomorrow is your friend's birthday and you forget to get him a gift. And so you can just go online and get the gift and um, have them delivered tomorrow. So you, can, you don't miss the birthday gift. And the third reason was many online shop for customer. Was it, um, you can, yeah, there are a lot of shop online. You can shop, you can even shop internationally, which you can go to other countries' side to shop. Um, with all of the choices people have online, sometimes they may not know which it's good to shop. Online shop offers reviews so people can compare before they purchase. Which brings you to my next point, it's uh, research capability. And um, first, online shopping allows you to compare each product and its price so people can get great deal. And second, online store can Online store give you the ability to share information and review with others, shopper who have a bit of first-hand experience with the product. And third, online shopping allow people to view different few, uh, feature of the product, have, which the product have, such as a website called uh, shoebuy.com, a leading shoe retailer, for example allows you to review most uh, shoes from all many of eight different angles, including a close-up. And online shopping does not only save our time, but also benefits to our environment, uh, which brings me to my, which brings you to my third point, it's um, it benefits to our environment. Um, first, many studies have, um, are showing that shopping online leads to reduce um, gas, uh, consumption and air pollution. Because so many of our car travel is uh, dedicated to shopping. And second, shopping online reduces the need for printing um, catalogs and exceed uh, packaging, with, uh, which save a lot of our trees. Um, in conclusion, shopping online is beneficial. First, it's convenience. Second, online, allow, online shopping allows people to do research before they buy. Uh, finally, it's good for our environment. Thank you. All right, well, the proposition's labeled pretty clearly, and you have a good layout of the secondary structure. I'm not sure what the controversy is on this uh, particular point. It sounds like a nice um, speech summarizing what the benefits are, and I don't know that anybody challenges some of the things that you're talking about. Uh, why these, uh, be you know, th there might be some element on the third point where uh, there is some controversy, but I think when it comes to uh, the convenience material that you have on the first point, the uh, comparison shopping, for instance, I'm not sure that anybody's uh, challenging that. Although, could it replace 
uh, brick and mortar shopping or um, is it as satisfying? I mean, that would be a place where maybe there is some controversy. Uh, to me, it just sounds like a, a simple outline of you know, a, a basic preference and it's not particularly controversial. Uh, I, the first point is really dependent on hypotheticals. You've got one example on the second point, that's the shoe retailer. Uh, I guess there might be some controversy here from the respondent thinking about difficulty that uh, people face when they shop online. There's a potent, there are potential problems and pitfalls there. You don't really discuss them, so that's why it's hard for me to figure out what's uh, the controversy on this point. On the third point, on all the, your stuff about the environmental benefits, it's all largely asserted the impact that uh, um, shopping has to do with the uh, environment. Uh, you, you claim that that's a lot of the driving that people do. I'm not sure how much of the driving it is that people do. By the way, all that stuff doesn't just uh, magically appear at the, at the computer. You know, it's not like you hit a button and you print up your product. If you're buying something, that has to be shipped also. So I, I assume that there's some cost involved in all of that. Um, and we would need a comparison. How much reduction is there? Uh, in the amount of energy that's being used or in the amount of uh, particulates being put in the atmosphere. We don't get any data on that, so it's largely asserted. All right, thank you.